We want to wish each and every one of you happy holidays, Merry Christmas, happy Hanukkah, happy Kwanzaa. Wasn't going to do a video, but I fared. Merry Christmas. I want to thank people who help partly help continue to run. I want to thank the handicappers who pay the money to be monitored on the site to prove that they're legit. I'm sure they've made some of or many of the users who follow Part I Help some cash. Christmas Eve didn't work out so well betting wise, but today, a full day of Christmas basketball. Topped off with a nightcap of football if you choose to watch such the game. I love to use the, when they use the term national television. I still don't believe ESPN is national television, but a lot of people have cable. Although if you look at the statistics, still about 75% of the world, at least the United States, has cable. So 25% don't. So there's two nationally televised games. Both are on ABC. I believe one is at 2 and one is at 5. 5 o'clock, obviously the big game. The Miami Heat will travel to Los Angeles. The Lakers are minus three. But ESPN does have games starting at noon all the way up to a nightcap. And then if you choose to do so on the NFL Network, the Dallas Cowboys head to Arizona. And last I looked, the line is somewhere between six and seven as a road favorite for the Cowboys. Sunday, the Eagles line is absolutely crazy. Can't remember when they were that big of a favorite. And I believe there are also four college hoops games love to see somebody put together a five team NBA party wouldn't that be nice to hit on Christmas Christmas Eve though not so good only one handicapper had a winning day sportsman took Tulsa with the 10 for five units we will add 500 to the bankroll Pretty much everybody else was on Hawaii, anywhere between the money line, which was your best pick. Rocky Sheraton was having a phenomenal week. Hawaii, minus the 10. Picks and predictions, Hawaii, minus the 9.5, depending on when he got the line. Max play, tough, tough break. Gino's winning ticket, Hawaii, minus the 10. Max play, tough break. And CT. Sports picks, Greg's picks and predictions.com is one of his websites where he does a weekly, weekly podcast. Picks and parlays.com, I believe, is the site. Or you can find Craig at ctsportspicks.com. Hope everyone has a great and wonderful Christmas. We spent a little time on the computer. Just remember today, not everyone has friends and family to be around. So some people will be on the computer wanting to chat. If it's someone you know, take 15 minutes out and chat with them. Just make sure they're okay. Holidays do crazy things to people sometimes. But for the most part, it's a great, beautiful day. It's a Saturday, which means I'll be working. We'll see if we do a Sunday video or not. If not, <clears throat> we will be back Monday. We are getting close to the end of December. The end of 2010. And a new... Handicapper of the Month for Percentage, and Handicapper of the Month for Bankroll. Happy Holidays to everyone, and thank you, thank you, thank you to all of you that support and make PartyHelp.com what it is. I'm going to try and make some changes in January, February-ish maybe. It'll be in the early part, first quarter of 2011. Just tweak the site a little more. I know my partner wants to make it a little more compact. He's more into the cosmetic end of it. And Rightly so, he does a decent job of it. Going to try and squish things down a little bit. It's not baseball season. we got to get some of the baseball charts all in the first quarter. And I'm going to try and do at least real short, simple, brief videos that at least on the weekends, at least one day on the weekend to kind of wrap things up. I know it's after football, so not everybody is, is enthused, but try and do the best we can. Maybe one day it'll be a full-time deal. We'll have live chat rooms every night. But for now, five days a week videos are going to have to survive. But thanks to everybody who helps support Party Help. Happy holidays to each and every one of you.